Hey guys, this is going to be an unboxing of the K-Bar Heavy Bowie Knife. Now, I just got this probably about 15 minutes ago, so I haven't opened it up or anything. Um, Alright, so let's get into this. Um, First thing I'm a little bit worried about is this little uh, spot on the box here. And I know um, that this is not the prettiest thing to look at. This has been here for a long, long, long time. Way before we even... Uh, moved here so you know that that can explain all the spills and that's why I had it covered up because it's ugly but then again this is a manly place it's not supposed to look all pretty so all right let's get into this like like I said this is a review slash unboxing at least I uh, think I said that all right and this is this is just a cheap crappy little pocket knife that I had for a while I I am excited. Uh, crap. Need to get these side spots too. Sorry guys. Just wanted to <clears throat> Oh, is the box gonna be wider? Oh, just gonna be a plain black box. That's a little bit disappointing. Whoa, this long. And then it has K Bar Knives Incorporate. Um, I do have the specs here. I'm gonna be listing it off. The sheath that it's supposed to be in is supposed to be leather. I don't know. All right. Um, K Bar since. 1898. Alright. Whoa. Oh, that's nice. Sorry, guys, it sounded a little bit gay here, but <laughs> this is cool. I, I really wanted this knife for a long time, and I finally got it for my birthday. Oh, my God. Alright. So, th this sheath is, is it's definitely not. Oh, yeah, it's leather. Um. I'm going to get out the knife in just a few seconds. Let me go ahead and get out the sheath real quick. I'm going to have to tear this son of a bitch open. That my camera just... Oh, never mind. Oh, it just slides out. Alright. This sheath, I hope I don't have any problems with. I don't know what texture this is on the back, but um, this is the leather. You guys can see the shape of it. Um... Alright. Oh my god, this is amazing. I've never unboxed a knife before. I've never, this is my first time. So, uh, that's where my camera's like doing all this different crap. Um, oh, limited lifetime warranty. Gonna have to read that. Just want it. Save it. I know you guys are like, get to the knife already. Sorry. Alright. <laughs> oh my god, I'm an idiot. Ooh. Holy. Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, wait. It doesn't, for some reason it doesn't look sharp. I'm not going to feel it up yet, but. Alright. And then what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to just start li listing off the specifications. I'm going to have the sheath right there. Alright. This thing weighs uh, 1.30 pounds, so it's pretty hefty, or heavy and hefty, I don't know. It's made out of 1080 carbon steel, which that can rust, but don't worry, it's going to be pretty easy to sharpen as long as you keep it well oiled in its sheath. You know, it'll be fine, so um, yeah. Now the blade length is 9 inches, uh, so that's that's a lot of blade right there. Um. It's, uh, counting the handle, it's 14 and 1 fourth inches, 
Now the um the edge or I believe it has a flat grind on it, but it has a see like it has those little things in the blade. I don't know if this is gonna be sharp. It should be, but it has a twenty degree angle on it. Um, and this is what I love about K bar. They they put these Kraton G handles, and these things are comfortable. Oh my God, I can't dis I can't say how much I love these handles. And my camera's doing some weird stuff here. It's flipping out all over the place. I hope you got this video doesn't turn bad. Um, and la last few parts is that thickness. Now this is a thick knife. Holy crap. That little nice and bowy design right there. Oh my god. That is a thick knife. It's uh, It says 0 0.250 um doesn't even give give the thing, but sink if it chickles around. No, it doesn't. It's really s solidly locked in there. Um, so yeah, now to top off this unboxing slash review, it's gonna be a paper cut test, which I had all the information on, just looking off of it. And uh, crap, wonder how I'm gonna do this. Uh, hmm. Really don't know. What about if I like? Ah, you got to remember, I don't have a tripod, so I can't really. I can't do that. Um. I, okay. What I'll do is, I guess I'll I'll just like put it facing upwards. I don't know. If I shut shut off this video, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna see how sharp it is. I'm gonna put the phone uh down so I can show you guys. Alright, let's see. Alright, hey guys. Um, alright. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? I'm not sure if you guys can see, but... Oh. Oh shit. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but I I was just holding it wrong. But it's sharp. Uh I'm not sure if it's razor sharp here. I'll kinda Yep, it's razor sharp. Um, well, I did not mean for this video to get this long, but I'm not sure if you guys could see that, but yes, it is razor sharp. I wiped the hair off. But once again, this knife is going to be amazing. I will, if this breaks or anything while batoning or anything, I'm just going to go ahead and in the description below, I'm going to go ahead and post like an update thing. And I'll tell you guys what happened. And I'll make a video on it. Alright guys, this is my first unboxing. My review of the heavy bowie knife from K-Bar. thing feels amazing, I'm telling you. Alright, so, you know, I'm going to be testing this out. This is sharp. I thought it wasn't sharp at first because it was just bending the paper. But, yeah, it, it is sharp. Alright guys, see you later.